everyone this is naturally your first i'm back again with another video so in today's video i would like to show you how you can make your natural gel using flaxseed and the beauty with the flaxseed gel it won't flake it doesn't have chemicals so it's a very natural gel you make it from food so here i have a cup of flax seeds i add four cups of already boiling water because i want the gel to start boiling almost immediately i boil my gel for five to ten minutes depending on how thick i want my gel to be so you need to keep stirring so that your seeds do not stick to the bottom of your pot uh, i'm using a wooden spoon so as you can see when it starts to boil the water is already starting to thicken so the longer you boil your seeds the thicker the gel will become so i boil mine for at least five to ten minutes and then when i'm done boiling immediately i do not wait i separate the water from the seeds using a sieve or a bigger strainer you could use a tea strainer if you like but i use uh, the bigger one so i separate the seeds from the gel whilst it's hot that way it's easier to remove i've seen others wait for it to cool down when you wait to, for it to cool down it thickens and it becomes harder for you to remove the gel let's check with the second one as you can see with the second one it's a bit difficult for the gel to come out because it has already started to thicken than the earlier one so i'll leave it at that i'm going to put back the flax seeds in the pot for reuse then immediately before it even cools down i add my oil this is optional you can use an oil of your choice i've chosen to use repair my hair by auntie jackie the argan oil by auntie jackie you can use an oil of your choice for example you can use olive oil or you can use coconut oil that's up to you so i put the oil and then i mix immediately before it thickens and then after mixing i put the gel uh, in the different bowls if you want you can put in an applicator bottle but i prefer to put mine in small balls like that as you can see the gel has started thickening it's still hot and that's the second ball and then we have the third fourth and fifth so there's a lot to go around because there are no preservatives added i only make enough for two uses so i have made five jars out of the four cups of water I, I added to the gel so i'll only keep two and i'll take the three to the salon so if you live in zambia please let me know in the comments down below if you would like to try the gel i have three jars to give away i used the gel to do my pemrod set and i loved the result I got amazing bouncy curls with no flakes or cakiness so I think this is the best gel I've used ever but you just have to make sure that when you make you keep it refrigerated let me know in the comments down below if you would like to try this gel and tell me your recipe I would like to learn from you please like if you like the video share subscribe and turn on your notification button so that you don't miss a thing whenever I upload new videos bye thank you for watching Thank you.